captaining the side. So now the requirement, 76 runs of 6 overs. That's just over 12 runs and over. Oh, Freddy. And Russo, is that taken? It is. Good catch. Afridi starts off with a wicket. Not the greatest of deliveries, but doesn't matter. He's got a wicket. Well, silence in uh, Maratha Arabian camp, but uh, this is a big wicket. I'm telling you, in the contest of the match, Afridi has brought the game back on the side of his team. Pakhtun, slightly short, but uh, skidding on. Russo didn't have the time to play it uh, more square. Didn't have the time, just could only manage to hit it. Straight down the throat of uh, Long. We got Hales, 30 of 12. Side up, Freddy. He's got a wicket of the first ball. Now, the requirement is 76 of 35 balls. That's a huge mountain to climb. Well, Bakhtun's made 121 for four. Right, we're ready. Second ball of the over. Oh, that's close. It's gone. Goal of the first ball. Afridi on a hat trick. What a magnificent delivery. Hurried on and Bravo. In serious trouble. Well, how many matches these two have played against each other and still Afridi getting win on a sucker punch. Win Bravo. Cardinal mistake going back. To Afridi trying to play for a single. And Afridi knew exactly what to do against Ben Bravo. Goes for a golden duck. And Maratha Arabians are 46 for 4 now. Well, look who's here. Virendra Sevag. He's come out to face the hat-trick ball. He's got a slip in. Shy Afridi. He's on fire. So Sevag hasn't has been out of cricket for a while, but uh, look at his record when he was playing. Look at that strike rate, the best of 122. He's on a hat trick. He's on strike. Afridi, oh, will that be out? Will that be out? In fact, it is. We render Sevag is the hat trick victim. Shahid Afridi. He's just created history, the first ever to get a hat trick in T10 cricket. Can you imagine if somebody would have told you that uh, on the first day of T20 League, we'll see a hat-trick and that too by Shahid Afridi. Look at that. Just that slider, quickish, no turn on it. Sevag, uh, just tentative, not too far forward. It would have crashed into the next stump. So good decision by the umpire and Afridi makes history. What a night. For the Pakhtun fans. This match virtually in the bag for the Pakhtuns. The Maratha Arabians struggling at 46 for 5. Seva. He's got 3 out of 3. And he's got 3 left. Let's see what he does here. Oh. Played it very late. And they're coming back for 2. Good running. Imad Watsim just waiting for the ball to come on to him. But let's take a look at that last dismissal. This is Virendra Sevag and the hat-trick victim. Well, flipping the leg stump, umpires.